Hey guys, welcome back to Station Music. Today we're gonna learn Hourglass by Catfish and the Bottom. So it's a pretty nice song, it's got that little riff. I'm gonna go through all the parts, so you got the verse, chorus, and the little bridge with all the whoa, 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 bits. So yeah, I'll put all the cards and everything over on the website, stationmusic.com, and put it uh, with top tips and everything like that. So if you wanna learn this song, stick with the video, go over the website, check out everything else, and I'll go to a close up and show you how to play it. Okay, so for this song you need the capo on the fourth fret. I've seen some people play it with the second on tabs and stuff online, so you can do that also. You just have to move everything along a bit. Um on the video that I've seen him playing live, he's got on the fourth and the music video is on the fourth, so I thought I'll learn it this way. Okay, so you're gonna start with all the frets are gonna be in relation, so normally that'd be the thirteenth, but we're gonna call it the ninth because it's the ninth away from the capo. So that's the ninth on the A string. You can hit the A string and the open D string here. So one, two, three, four, five. And you're gonna move to the seventh on the A and the open D. You hit the A and D together. Second and D, fourth and D. Not fourth, sorry, fifth and D. You got That again, so obviously, you be a bit looser with your strum, you can hit like that, and you can hit more than just the two strings that I pointed out. Okay, and then you go to that. Following his melody, so go on. So you got E minor chords, so all the chords for these will be on the website. It's so the second fret of the A and D. So it's down, down, up, up, down. Then you're gonna go to this cool F sharp minor chord. So you're gonna slide your E minor shape down so it's the fourth fret of the A and D. Infuse your third finger and pinky for those. And your first finger is gonna play it, the second fret of the G string. So you got E minor. E minor, down, down, up, up, down, and F sharp minor, up, up, down, up, up, down. So you got, you got E minor again, down, down, up, up, down. You got, so you got, so you go to a G chord, so I'll just play it from your E minor, change to your third finger goes over to the second, uh, third fret of the big E. So. You can hit that with an up strum. And F sharp note, so second, well it's not really F sharp note, sorry. Um, it, it would be an F sharp chord if there's no capo. Uh, and then, so that'd be on the second fret. Then you go open, so that'd be E minor chord again. So you go down, down, down. Back to the F sharp note, and then you go to a D chord. Okay, and that repeats around a few times for the verses. Okay, then you go to a chorus, which you go to a B minor chord. Well, it's actually D sharp minor. But yeah, we'll call it B minor because that's what it is in relation to capo. So a second fret, bottom five strings, and then you're on the third fret of the B, fourth fret of the D, 
but I'll fret the tune. You do two bars, so it's down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Then you're going to go to a G card, so you can play a big, like Oasis style G, so second fret of the A string, third fret of the big E, then you got third fret of the B and little E. Just one bar, so down, down, up, up, down, then you go to a D. So it's second fret of the G, second fret of the E, third fret of B, and one bar of that. So you got So you go, that would be a second fret of the G, D, and B, or you can do it just a bar across and keep the open A string. So two of the bars again, so down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Then you're going to go to your G chord. Oh, no, no, sorry, I'm going to so down, down, up. B man. One bar, so down, down, up, up, down, up, G, one bar. Same again, down, down, up, up, down, up, then D. So what you've got for that chorus, I play all the way through. So you've got B minor for two bars. bit in the song is the bridge bit so it's that kind of bit so if I could sing but you got here one two G three and again here same strum pattern So that is that whole song. So don't uh, forget to subscribe to the site and YouTube and everything like that. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye now.